I first do a setup for this problem, and it says that the Billy and Bobby can mow their grandparents' lawn together in 98. So I'm going to put 98 minutes here, and I always, my first column is always my names, whether it's pipes or people, and I always have it together. And it says Billy could mow the lawn by himself in 40 minutes less time than it would take Bobby. So we don't know Bobby's time, so we're going to call it X. But we know that Billy's time, he can mow it in 40 minutes less than Bobby, so that would be X minus 40. And we're trying to figure out how long would it take Bobby to mow the lawn by himself. So we're trying to find X. Now that we have individual times in this first column, we need to rep 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 represent those times working with somebody else. And the way you do that is you take the reciprocal. So that would be 1 over X minus 40, 1 over X, and 1 over 98. And that represents, like, Bobby's is 1 over X. It takes, he does 1 over X of the job working with somebody else. And the way you write your equation, you sum Billy and Bobby's rates. So 1 over X minus 40 plus 1 over X equals together. And that's your equation. And now you need to clear your fractions by multiplying every term on both sides by the LCD. And the LCD would be 98, an X, and an X minus 40. So when you multiply through with that LCD, multiply it times 1 over X minus 40, that leaves you 98X plus, here the X is canceled, and you're left with 98 times X minus 40. Here the 98 cancels, and you're left with X times X minus 40. And we want to solve this equation for x. So this is 98x plus, distribute the 98, that's 98x minus 98 times 40, which is 3,920, equals x squared minus 40x. Now let's combine like terms on the left-hand side, and that gives you 196x minus 3920 equal x squared minus 40x. This is a quadratic equation. We need to get zero on one side. So that's gonna be x squared. We need to subtract 196 from both sides. So we already have negative 40 minus 196, and that's negative 236x. Add the 3920 to both sides. And there's your equation. I don't know how to factor that, so I'm just going to use the quadratic quadratic formula. That would be negative B, which would be negative of a negative is positive 236 plus or minus the square root of B squared minus 4AC. Now, A is 1, B is negative 236, and C is 3920. So, negative B plus or minus B squared, so that's going to be negative 236 squared which is 55,696, I'm using a calculator, B squared minus four times A times C, which is 3920. And that's all over two times A, which would just be two. So that's gonna be 236 plus or minus the square root of 55696 minus four times 3920. And that's 40,016, 40,016, all over 2. And then 236 plus or minus, let's see if we can take the square root of that. Square root of 40016 is not a perfect square. It's about 200. So I'll just put that divided by 2. And... That gives you the plus one and the minus 236 plus 200 divided by 2 is 218. And then 236 minus 200 divided by 2 is 18. And that's not going to work because if you look at x minus 40, 18 minus 40 would give you a negative number. 
So your answer's got to be 218.